hello guys welcome back to the my youtube channel today i am going to solve this hacker rank problem based on the algorithm implementation problem name is as given breaking the record every day someone is making a record and someone breaking the record based on the scenario problem name is as given breaking the record maria play college basketball and want to go pro each session she she maintain a record of her play she tabulate the numbers of the time she break her session record for the most point and the least point in the game <coughs> point scored in the first game establish her record for the session and the she begin counting from here for example assume her score for the session are represented in the array scores 12 24 <coughs> sorry 10 and 24 score in the la in the same order as she gave as the game played she would tabulate her result as follow this is the sample table that represent her scores and the no, number of the time she break her record we'll discuss in the next sample input so let's move to the input format the first line contains the an integer n the number of the game the second line contains the n space separated integer describing the respective value score 0 to 1 and n it goes to n minus 1 the value of the n will be more than 1 and the less than equal to the 1000 and the score value of the score will be the greater than 0 gre 0 0 or greater than or 0 and the less than equal to the 10 to the power 8 and we have to print the number of the times she break the record for the maximum value and the minimum value let's under Uh, understand this the sample input the first input uh, is 9 it means uh, c played the 9 games and uh, c scored the this value for every match okay and this is the output that we have to return so this is the game 0 c scored 10 highest score the is the 10 and the lowest score is the 10 in the game 1 c scored 5 so maximum score was the 10 it is not greater than so maximum score the will remain the same and but the lowest score was the 10 and she scored 5 so she break she is breaking her lowest score for the next game she scored 20 her maximum score was the 10 so she is, is breaking her maximum score so now her maximum score score will be 20 and the minimum will remain same in the next game she is scoring again 20 but the 20 was her maximum score so nothing is going to be changed in the subsequent next game she scored 4 but uh, uh, her lowest score was the 5 and it is uh, lesser than the 5 so she is uh, breaking her lowest score and now the lowest score will become 4 in the next game she scored 5 and the maximum score was the 4 so it is not greater than the maximum a uh, minimum score is the 4 uh, but it is not the lesser than the 4 so nothing is going to be changed uh, change in this case in the next game she scored 2 her maximum score was 20 and now her uh, minimum score is 2 uh, 4 uh, was 4 uh, so it is lesser than the 4 so again she is breaking her lowest score record so for the next time she is scoring uh, 25 and her earlier score was 20 so she is uh, scoring uh, uh, higher than the highest score so she is breaking again the highest score and the lowest score will remain same for the next and the last game she scored 1 uh, her uh, last scored was 2 so she is breaking her lowest score 
finally she is uh, break to twice she break she is breaking her highest score and the fourth time she is breaking her the lowest score so the we have to return two and the four let's move to the coding section so that we will write some code and uh, we'll see all these thing in action the return type of this method is array integer array so i'm going to create an array of type integer and its size will be two only because i need to return only two value so i am going to fix its size by two for the first game minimum value will be the scores of zero and the maximum value will be also scores of zero i need to store some temporary variable uh, create some temporary variable where i can store the maximum uh, whenever whenever she will break the minimum score and the maximum score and i am initializing with the zero integer max score is equal to zero now array is ready and uh, maximum and minimum temp variable is also ready so i'm going to use for loop for loop inside i'm going to i less than is equal to scores dot length and i plus plus here i added a zero but it would be one because i already stored the zeros index value in the minimum and maximum so i will go through the from the one index okay first condition if uh, scores of i greater than max then max becomes the scores of i and max score will be updated if scores of i scores of i lesser than minimum then min will become scores of i and mean scores will be updated by one finally i stored everything so it's time to place data into the scores array score of i not i zero is equal to first time so quite the maximum value max score score of score of one in one index will be the mean score okay i stored the two variable in the score variable uh, so now it's time to return i'm returning a score so let's run this code to test the simple test case validation yeah it passed the all simple test case let's again submit this code to for final evaluation yeah it passed the all test cases without any time issue so guys if you think this video is helpful for you then please hit the like button and subscribe my channel if you're not subscribed yet and don't forget to share with your friend and finally thank you for watching